Salvation is my best gift ever You're the tree of life I was lost, now I am found Let's talk about the value of the Bible after the truth will break out The truth is coming out, the truth is coming out It's just a matter of time, whether you like it or not the truth is coming out. The question is, what's going to be the value of the Bible, the Word of God, after the truth comes out? Because people will realize that indeed this is the Word of God. This is the truth. The only universal truth we have to be based on instead of following man. Let's see. The truth is coming out. It's a matter of time. It's just a matter of time, whether you like it or not, it's coming out. Let's read in Brook 21, 24. Until the time of the Gentiles is fulfilled. So the time of the Gentiles is being fulfilled. We've been lied to centuries after centuries, and now time has come. We are in that time, defined time, defined moment, when the Lord God said, the truth is coming out. God said, Nothing hidden won't come to light. This is the moment. This is the time. The time has come until the time of the Gentiles is fulfilled. We are here and the value of the Bible is going to show itself when scriptures are going to start jumping off the pages. It's happening now. If you're still sleeping, you don't see it now, but it's happening right now, right here. Let's see. People will wish to read the Bible in one week and even possible. In one day, people will wish to read and understand the Bible in one day, but perhaps it's going to be too late. It's now start reading the Bible and send the Bible because this is the truth that is going to jump off the pages of the Bible and show in the face of every human being living now and in the future. It's going to happen. Whether you like it or not, it's coming. It's just a matter of time. Luke 21, 24 until the time of the Gentiles is fulfilled. That time is being fulfilled right now, right here. There will be total chaos because of total deception. Total chaos is going to be caused by total deception. People have been deceived and then they want to wake up. They wake up will cause chaos because people will be running back and forth Searching for the truth, the meaning of the truth, the meaning of the word, the meaning of what's happening, especially what's going to be happening right that time. This is what's going to cause the chaos because people will panic trying to figure out what's going on. This is going to happen whether you like it or not. It's coming. The time of the Gentile is being fulfilled. The rules of the world. So what's going to be the direction of the rules of the world? Of course, the rules of the world are going to try to hide what's going to happen because they will try to prevent people from preaching the word of God, teaching the word of God, and sharing the word of God because it's going to cement and affirm that indeed the word of God is true. Therefore, the rulers of the world are not going to be happy about that because they're going to start stopping people from preaching the word of God, saying that it's not true, but Remember, it's a déjà vu. You saw this before, it happened before when they banned people from the Bible and prevent people from preaching the word of God and of course crucify people when they were found with the word of God. It's coming back. Nothing new under the sun. As it happened in the past, it's happening right now as we are approaching the time of the truth. Now, let's read Amos 8, 11. Behold, Days are coming, declares the Lord God, when I will send a famine on the land, not a famine of the bread or thirst for water, but rather the hearing of the word of God. So, God is going to cause the famine, not of food, but hearing the words of God. So, people are going to do anything they can to hear the word of God. So, today, we are calling you guys to come and listen and learn and start the word of God. You're stubborn, but time has come when you, you yourself, wish to listen and hear or learn and study the word of God. Perhaps 
is not going to be anywhere to be found, but time is now. Start now if you love yourself right now. So people will start to understand. So the chaos, the changes, the word of God, the truth, the lies, everything crops at the same time is going to make people realize and understand indeed they have been lied to. Jeremiah 16, 19. So we are in head lies. This is what's going to happen. People are going to wake up and understand indeed they have been lied to. It's up to you. Wake up now. Give your life to God. Wake up now. Give your life to Christ. Yeshua HaMashiach, the Savior, the one who can show the way. He is the way, life, and truth. This truth is coming right now, right here. It has started. I believe you are aware. If not, wake up now and seek for the kingdom while you still can. Thank you very much for watching. May God bless you. Shalom, shalom, shalom. Salvation is my best gift ever. You're the tree of life. I was lost, now I am found.